Object versus subject relative pronouns. A relative clause starts with a relative pronoun. The two common relative pronouns are which and who for things and people respectively. But it is important to note that a relative pronoun can be the subject or the object of a relative clause. For example, in the sentence, this is the course which takes six months, the relative pronoun which is the subject of the relative clause. Which is the subject, takes is the verb, and six months is the object. However, in the sentence, this is the course which I took, the relative pronoun which is the object of the relative clause. I is the subject, took is the verb, and which is the object. Similarly, in the sentence, he is the teacher who speaks three foreign languages. The relative pronoun who is the subject of the relative clause. Who is the subject, speaks is the verb, and three foreign languages is the object. And in the sentence, he is the teacher who I met the relative pronoun who is the object of the relative clause. Who is the object, I is the subject, and met is the verb. Of course, when who is in the position of an object, then you can also replace it with the word whom. If you do so, your sentence becomes He is the teacher whom I met. That's it. Now you know how a relative pronoun can be the subject or the object of a relative clause.